Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to guide you through setting up a ShadowSox configuration and using it with HTTP Injector VPN. Whether you're new to VPNs or just exploring ShadowSox, right in. The first step is to install HTTP Injector on your device. Open the Google Play Store and type HTTP Injector in the search bar. Once you find the app, tap on it and click Install. The installation process will only take a few minutes. Once installed, launch the app and you'll be greeted with the home screen of HTTP Injector. But before we proceed, let's first create a ShadowSox server if you don't already have one. To create a ShadowSox server, follow these steps. 1. Open any browser on your device and type UDP Custom in the search bar. 2. From the search results, visit the official UDP Custom website. 3. On the home page, click on the menu icon, usually three horizontal lines. 4. From the list, select SH Servers. 5. A list of different protocol servers will be displayed. Choose ShadowSox Server. 6. Select your preferred server location from the options, then click Create. 7. On the next page, check the reCAPTCHA box and click Generate. Within seconds, your ShadowSox server details will be displayed. Copy these details because we will need them for configuring HTTP Injector. Now that we have our ShadowSox server details, let's set, let's set up HTTP Injector VPN. 1. Open HTTP Injector. 2. On the home page, below the Start button, click the arrowhead button to open the server list page. 3. Under Tunnel Type, select ShadowSox Server. 4. In the Connect form, leave the settings as they are and click the Save button. 5. Now, let's add our ShadowSox server. Click the Settings icon at the top. A new window will open. Select Shadow Socks. At the top of the page, click the small plus plus button to open a new pop-up window. Paste the Shadow Socks server details you copied earlier. Click OK to import the Shadow Socks server successfully. 6. Go back to the home page and simply click the Start button to connect. And that's it! You're now connected to a secure, fast yet and unlimited internet connection. If this tutorial was helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Happy browsing!